What's going on everyone? Darkwater here back in Tastemaker. Last we left off, we started the second floor. So I'm thinking maybe we start to look at getting some additional seating up here and really allowing people to really kind of spread out as well as looking at potentially starting to get burgers on the menu. So let's go ahead and actually take this all the way over here. We'll take this to about here. I think we might start with this. So that's quite a bit of room that we're going to be messing with here. Um, go ahead and add some curtains up here just to get the decor up a little bit. Um, go ahead and add in the windows as well. Wish you could just take out the window by itself. But we will go with this for now. Um, I guess menu's too small. Decoration grade would be nicer if my food arrives sooner. So we might need to increase the amount of staff we currently have. Go ahead and leave two people cooking. Go ahead and increase to four people serving. Four people doing dishes. And let's go ahead and hire another one. Two. And you two are just going to be doing cleaning. We've got four people doing serving and four people collecting dishes. So hopefully we won't be running into any clean dishes issues, as well as making sure that our, we're getting food out of the kitchen as fast as possible. So the wait time's increasing, which is good. Hygiene's really great. Decor is okay. Price is good. Menu variety is bad. So I think I want to add more seating up here before I get into adding in anything else onto the menu. Can't afford that chair, of course not. One, two, space, one, two, space. And then another side table, I guess. Or maybe we could put the fish tank over there or something. Maybe do a tree or a cactus. We are out of meat. Okay, well. Crank it back up to 22, I guess. Um, let's go ahead and continue to expand some of the seating. So the income's at 1413, which is very good. Um, not enough stoves to keep up with demand, okay. Um, what did we do last month? 1377, 81 steaks. That's a lot of steak. So, okay. We are going to need more stoves. So maybe we'll drop another three in there if I can afford it. Menu's too small. Ooh, where, 
gonna run out of stick again. There he goes. Too close for comfort. Let's keep it at 25, I think. So how much is another stove? 100, so let's go ahead and get one. And I want one more. Two. Ooh, I can only get one more pan. That's fine. Got all kinds of meat cooking. However, yeah, our net was only 32 last month. This month we're at minus 300, and that's okay. We'll hopefully make it back up. We only sold 60 steaks last time, last month. Just got another order of steak coming in. Do we have anybody eating upstairs? Mm, got two steaks sitting there, so apparently somebody went to the bathroom. Going to need to add bathrooms up there, I think. Um, so real quick, let's close down for a quick second, because I don't want to... We're nearing the end of the month, and I don't want to lose the money. Let's go ahead and do that. Add in another two pans, because I know I'm going to end up getting another stove. Uh, let's pause for a sec. I think I'm going to add a single bathroom up here. Right here. I will probably end up running bathrooms all the way back on the, the second floor as well. Uh, let's go ahead and get a door there. Let's get a toilet. And a nice sink in front of the window. Nope. Can't afford a sink yet gonna be a bit but we had a profit of 305 income of over 1200 which is great news not enough brooms I've got two vacuums and a, a broom so I should be okay but we've got a few people eating up here um, but yeah, I think we're going to extend bathrooms back here. I suppose I could add some more, uh, slot machines and maybe even the claw machine. I wonder what the claw machine does. Maybe that'll be something we invest in down the road here. And I don't need a toilet, I need a sink. There we go. Uh, can I get a couple more tables up here? Thinking about also dropping the price a little bit, maybe? Just to get more people in here, but I think more people would also come in if the menu was a bit more expanded. What did we make last month in steak? Two twenty or twelve twenty four.
got a feeling, though, if I add burgers, I'm really going to need to expand the size of the kitchen. Um, let's reduce the, or the meat just a little bit. Also very tempted to put wine back on the menu. So, what if... Yeah, let's... Go ahead and get some wine in here. And then we will add wine back to the menu. That's kind of something quick and easy. That we'll be able to, uh... I know I'm out of wine. It's, it's, it's fine. But I feel like we've got a lot of empty seats right now. Uh, let's reduce the amount of meat we're getting in, I think. Just a couple. Because if we decide to do burgers, we're going to have to come back a little bit further. Yeah, because I won't be able to get all of it into the kitchen. Although I can get a little bit more seating down here. Storage racks are full, that's fine. Hopefully people are buying wine. Two people bought wine last month. This month we're up to 10. Ooh. The amount of steak people bought is suddenly dropped by a lot. So that's 54. Huh. Let's come over here. Nope, not where I wanted. I want this. We're going to increase the amount for wine to 18. So it's a little bit more than the steak. Take down the amount of wine here. It seems like nobody's buying wine either. Fridges are full. Let's take down the amount of meat. Yeah, I feel like I'm not getting the foot traffic in whenever I added wine to the menu again. I think, think it might just be sticking with just steak for the time being. So, yeah, we'll, let's take wine back off the menu. It's kind of a little experimentation process here. So we'll go ahead and just let wine run through. Um, you know what? Let's take meat down as well. Because we're sitting at 47. Don't think we're going to need all that right now. What if we reduce the amount for steak down a coin? See if that gets more people coming in. And you know what, let's go ahead and take wine down to 13 just to kind of clear through it. Menu can be approved, I know.
All right, so question. What is, okay, for burgers, the only thing I'm getting in is meat and flour. And the initial coin is 25. So flour is two, meat is four, so we're looking six. So 19 in profit versus steak, which is 17 and so it's basically a profit of 13. So maybe we need to flip the entire menu from steak to burgers because that will allow us to have a larger profit margin. So that might actually be the better way to go. Uh, how are we doing this month? Oh, we just started this month. Last month we we're up to 818. That's okay. Uh, net. Oh, that was. Last month we netted plus five, which is good. Okay, I can deal with that. Um, but yeah, we're clearing out the wine, selling more steak. Did I take the price all the way down to 13? Oh, I hit the wrong one. <laughs> Wine should be down to 13. Steak, we're leaving it. Steak, we'll leave it 17. That would explain things. It's, we're fine with the wine glass storage. Uh, I'm actually going to take this, put it next to the bathrooms upstairs. I'm going to take the vacuum. We're going to put it here. Uh, where's the other vacuum? There it is. We're going to take the other vacuum, put it there. We're going to take the broom, put it there. Keep it out of the kitchen. Uh, let's go ahead and take wine from the menu. Now we're back to only doing steak. You, since we're going to do burgers, goes to bread. Or flour. So I'm thinking three ovens and three dough mixers, maybe? Oh, we're probably going to need a lot more than that. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it. So, yeah, I think we're going to go to burgers. I think burgers only is going to be the better way to go because our profit margin is probably going to be a lot higher with that. Uh, this month, we're at 629. So we've sold more steaks than we did last time. Well, at a higher higher amount. So we looks like we are gonna net something on the plus side, which is gonna be good. So yeah, I think I'm gonna leave it here. We'll let the finances balance out, get a little bit of money, and we will start to flip the kitchen from doing steaks to burgers. Uh, appreciate you guys for being here. And look forward to seeing you guys again in Tastemaker soon. And as always, I hope you guys have yourselves an awesome day. Bye.